Very good. Well, are you seeing me all right? Greetings, young explorers. Here I am again, Commander McBrag, on the next leg of our journey. I have traced the location of Squeaky Nut based on his last uh, note that he wrote to us, and obviously you have followed along and gotten here with me, so good job and well done. Thank you so much for your help in figuring out where Squeaky had gone to. Unfortunately, once I got to this beautiful city, as he described it, and it is in fact a quite a lovely city, I could not find him. I did, however, find a gentleman who told me a monkey wearing a helmet with goggles handed him this note and said if he were to see a man with a large mustache speaking in English and wearing a uh, telescopic monocle, <clears throat> that, I sh that the note should be given to me. And so I've got a note from Squeaky, another one. So Squeaky's note this time says... Uh, dear Commander, I couldn't wait. I have traveled south and crossed a small sea until I came to a large continent. Another continent across a small sea. I had to climb a very tall mountain range in the country of Algeria. Oh, well this time at least he knows the name of the country of Algeria. That's some help. Everywhere I looked was hot and dry desert. Yes, that's to be expected in Algeria. I traveled south on the prime meridian to the next country and went to a place that was once known for treasures of gold and salt. Hmm. Gold and salt. I stopped in this country's capital. So... The clues that we got from this note are that he went south from his last location, which was where I am right now. Uh, yeah, then he crossed a small sea until he came to a large continent. So a different continent across a small sea. He climbed mountain range in Algeria. Hmm. So, what is the name of the mountain range in Algeria? I wish he knew that. Everywhere I looked was hot and dry desert. Yes, we know. I traveled south on the prime meridian to the next country and went to a place that was known for, the tre for its treasures of gold and salt. Mm -hmm. Now, let's see. Uh, and then he stopped in the country's capital. So, these are the things that we've got to find out. We've got to know what sea he crossed what continent he went into, what uh, mountain range he climbed, what country he ended up in, and what city is he waiting for us in. We'll find that out, and we will rush to his aid, and then pursue the serpipod. I'm excited. I can tell that he's excited. He's getting closer. And as we follow him, we'll get closer too. So thanks for coming along, young explorers. And I'll see you next time. Until then, safe journeys.